nonstop energy. Well, I could not even imagine. And just for example, last night, you did a show last night that was 90 minutes starting at 7.30. That's right. Then you went through that. Then you came here. You're here this morning. That's right. Uh, doing all of this. It's nonstop. I don't sleep anymore. <laughs> no. All right. So where do you get the energy? Seriously. I mean, look at you. Well. I mean, I, we've known each other a long time. Yeah. We've passed. You don't, you don't ever get older. Well, thank you. <laughs> It's quite funny because, you know, people are kind of shocked when they hear that I'm 54 years old and, and they say, Where, how do you keep your youth? I have found something, Dr. Phil, that uh, I think is the closest thing to the fountain of youth. Oh, you do have a secret. I have a secret and I've never really talked about it. Well, I've been doing this for the last two years. <laughs> it's called ProTandem and it works. And I'm telling everybody about this. You feel differently. I do. Because you're running around like a chicken with your head cut off. Yeah. And but, I mean, you're hitting the times, you're getting where you're supposed I to be. I have you're to be on the spot all the time. You want to get an edge on turning back the clock with just a few pills? Who doesn't? Well, it's no longer science fiction, but science possibility, a potential breakthrough. As I found out firsthand, there may be a way to erase years, at least inside my body. Granted, it's down the road, but some scientists are wondering if a new pill I took might offer a very long life. It may not look like the fountain of youth, but inside this nondescript building, I'm about to become part of an exciting experiment, a kind of guinea pig. Dr. McCord, okay. I'm here at the University of Colorado in Denver to meet Dr. Joe McCord, a world-renowned scientist. This is uh, pretty exciting stuff you're finding, huh? It is. We're very excited about it. His latest research could very well unravel the mystery of aging itself. And as decades of experiments may have the potential of adding years to people's lives and possibly prevent chronic diseases like cancer, diabetes, and heart disease. It all centers around this small yellow pill, and for me, it begins with a blood test. Here, can you scoop? Yeah, there we go. It wouldn't be the first time I've given blood for this company. <laughs> they want to check my levels of something called T-bars, which is a rough indicator of a person's actual age. T-bars can identify a condition known as oxidative stress, a kind of measure of the wear and tear on our bodies. Oxidative stress, like the rusting of an engine, is not a good thing. Bad for the body. Leading to disease. Leading to disease and leading to malfunction and importantly leading to what we call aging. It is a slow progression of increasing oxidative stress. That's the main characteristic biochemically of the aging process. The problem of aging begins with the very food we eat to give us energy. As our cells burn that food, they also release toxic chemicals. Those chemicals, you may know them as free radicals, react with all the components of our cells, literally bombarding them millions of times per second, damaging all our cells. The result? Oxidative stress. And we all have it. The body fights back with a system of defenses. It makes two antioxidant enzymes, catalase and SOD, whose job is to gobble up the free radicals before they can harm our cells. So, doctor, how often do I take these? And so, here I go. With that swallow, I've just become part of a potentially landmark scientific experiment. Doesn't taste bad. Hmm. It's called protandum, and tests on both mice and humans have already shown that it revs up the manufacture of those good enzymes in our bodies. More enzymes, fewer free radicals to harm us. Right now, all we know is that this preparation decreases oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is not a disease, just like aging is not in itself a disease, but it's something that accompanies and is attached to, to many disease processes. So you can see the age-related... Normally, oxidative stress, measured by those T-bars, increases with age. But in Dr. McCord's tests, taking just one pill of protandum a day reversed that trend for everyone at every age, even for an 80-year-old. They all are reduced to the level of oxidative stress that one would expect, frankly, in a, in a newborn or a very young child. So just what's in this seemingly incredible pill? Well, actually, its roots are very humble. 
Protandum is a combination of five plant ingredients. Some you may know, green tea or turmeric, a spice used in Indian cooking. Others, withania somnifera and Silibum marianum, are more exotic. There's a huge human experience with each of these ingredients. Uh, they've been used often in traditional medicine in India and China and uh, many other cultures. In some cases, centuries and centuries. And so, ancient Eastern healing and modern Western medicine may soon be working together. High oxidative stress is associated with more than aging. It's been linked to hundreds of illnesses. It's at the very center of many diseases. Liver disease, diabetes, emphysema, asthma. Uh, uh, I've studied all of these, strokes, heart attacks. Even mental disease? Yes. Depression? Alzheimer's disease, depression. Dr. James Crapo with the National Jewish Medical Center in Denver is also researching protandum for the company. We make no claims about curing any disease or preventing any disease. Um, we hope that when enough studies are done, perhaps such claims might be able to be made in the future. Clinical studies to assess protandum in both diabetes and heart disease should start in three to four months. But what about my progress? After nearly two weeks now, it's time to get my results. Dr. McCord calculates the numbers. The result, my level of oxidative stress has declined dramatically. 45%, that's, that's excellent. Just look at where I fall on the graph, before and after. Which if extrapolated back is, is the level you would see in a newborn baby. Would you suggest I keep taking the supplement? I would. Um, I can't guarantee it's going to extend your life. I can't guarantee it's going to uh, eliminate any diseases or cure any diseases. But we do know that oxidative stress is part of those disease processes. I don't want to wait until I'm 80 years old and find out that I should have taken it. The company that makes Protandum says its tests show the pill made from ingredients used for centuries is absolutely safe. But because it's being sold as a nutritional supplement and not a drug, Protandum does not need FDA approval for safety. Major universities and government agencies initiated and continue self-funded studies following the ABC primetime investigative report you just viewed that originally aired in 2005. These studies continue to reveal more scientific evidence about Protandum's unique benefits. They are published in major scientific and medical journals. The next video will bring you up to date. This is what I call a vertical disruption. It totally challenges their paradigm. We're going to completely turn conventional wisdom on its ear. It is one of those cutting edge discoveries. It's enormous what this can do for health. It's a lot bigger than us. It's a lot bigger than all of us collectively. And that's why there's so many universities that are studying. Developed after 40 years of research and exclusively for Life Vantage, ProTandem is a true scientific breakthrough in anti-aging. ProTandem has been reported on ABC, NBC, and PBS, featured in the Wall Street Journal, and described in CNN Chief Medical Correspondent Dr. Sanjay Gupta's book, Chasing Life, The Quest for Immortality. ProTandem's creator, Dr. Joe McCord, is a world-renowned scientist and a pioneer in free radical biology. Dr. McCord is the discoverer of the key anti-aging enzyme, superoxide dismutase. His role in the discovery is so significant, the enzyme is measured in McCord units. When I was a graduate student at Duke University, my thesis research was the discovery of a new enzyme called superoxide dismutase. This enzyme had the odd function of scavenging free radicals in the human body. For Dr. McCord's discovery of superoxide dismutase and his contributions in free radical biology, he was awarded the Elliott Crescent Medal. This medal is awarded to distinguished inventors and scientists, putting Dr. McCord in the same company as Pierre and Marie Curie, Alexander Graham Bell, Orville Wright, and Henry Ford. Dr. Joe McCord has devoted his life's work to the study of free radicals, their role in aging, and the many problems associated with aging. Free radicals were known to be involved in a lot of damaging 
chemistry, chemistry that's involved in the decay and the rusting phenomenon of, of metals. When you break it down to what free radicals are, that is cellular damage at the cellular level. It, it's, it's damaging of the cells, and that damage that is caused, that's what oxidative stress is. Oxidative stress, in layman's terms, is rusting from the inside out. Consumers spend billions every year on antioxidants in the form of food and supplements, hoping to reduce these free radicals. But antioxidants from these sources can only eliminate one free radical for every one antioxidant molecule you consume. ProTandem is scientifically proven to slow cellular damage caused by free radicals. Taking one ProTandem one time per day for 30 days turns on these anti-aging enzymes in your body. Your own enzymes eliminate free radicals at a rate of one million to one. So one molecule of superoxide dismutase can react with up to one million free radicals per second, every second. We found, as many other scientists had documented, that there is a progressive increase in T-bars in your blood the older you get. When these same people took protandum for 30 days, the age-dependent increase in lipid peroxidation was completely eliminated. After protandum, we could no longer distinguish the 80-year-old from the 20-year-old. The statement that protandum supplementation can completely eliminate the age-dependent increase in oxidative stress is a very powerful statement. It's been peer-reviewed. It's even been scrutinized by review regulatory agencies and completely validated. Protandum is protected by three U.S. patents. Universities around the world continue to initiate and fund their own studies of protandum and to evaluate how this anti-aging breakthrough can prevent and improve many of the hundreds of problems associated with aging. So many people that's, that's looking for something more, that need something more, um, they want to become healthier, they want to become wealthier, they want to be able to pay the bills. People are struggling because they are depending on a model that's not working, just simply is not working. We can't continue heading in a direction that's not working for us and expecting a different result. So we have to shift. We've got to change. We've got to ask, what can I do better? What can I do differently?